made of paper dolls, crisp, clear, cut out of a stencil. And we go round and round, holding hands, keeping our heads held high and pointed, pointed toward, toward the sky. sky. Paper, paper dolls, dolls like you and I. But I'm the rebellious paper doll. Some little kid in preschool made me abandoning the stencil for a free for all. But they wouldn't put me in the recycling where I belong, so now I'm settled in the trash with my paper limbs and paper brain. And if I just set it on fire, all my memories will be erased. Some people just want to see the world burn, but I speak with a fiery passion glowing behind my eyes. And I wouldn't let anyone else touch the matches I keep in my back pocket, just in case we start to cry. We can make ourselves burn paper, paper dolls, dolls like, like you and I. I. When you threaten to take the lives we work so hard to create, I make sure that the wastebasket always has a water bottle so that we can douse the flames and make only ash, the burned up memories and origami cranes. Paper dolls like you and I have crayon hair and fragile eyes, and I can't bear to light fire to this recycled home we've made. These waxy limbs and triangle dresses, dresser, <laughs> these preschoolers coloring shiny tresses, we are masterpieces to those who know of a world where paper, paper dolls, dolls like you and I are the reality. But I choose to hold a matchbox because I find it to be less orthodox and this sort of box is one I can think outside of. And I am not a match locked inside, I am just the lick of a flame, blue songs of sadness rising from within me. And matchbooks don't quite contain that extent of knowledge and people only use them for the conveniency of their size. But that's a misguided and miscommunicated message sent out to kids playing with paper, paper dolls like, like you, you and I. I. Jumbled matchboxes just take up space, and matchbooks just help keep the trash away. Your unorthodox matchbox fire starter just makes it harder for me to breathe in our home. The blue basket planet, defined by its garbage and preschool cutouts, this blue basket planet is all I have left. So how dare you even try to light it aflame? Your matchboxes are just something that can't exist around fragile paper dolls like you and I, and I will not hesitate to run away. Maybe I was taught differently than you, but I live in fear with my fingers trembling as I try to grasp the side of the trash can to escape and try to figure out how to respond to the questions that are shot at me everywhere I turn on poison arrows that want to pierce my porcelain skin and inject the happy days of childhood and paper dolls into my veins. Maybe you didn't mean to shatter my performance, but maybe you did, and the uncertainty is killing me. Because maybe if your questions escalated, my curtains would fall and everything would shine in a new heavenly light. And perhaps that would be for the better, and maybe I wanted that to happen. But what do I know? I'm just a child playing with paper, paper dolls, dolls like, like you and I. I. But of course, if I carried out my threat, all those matchbook box matches would lay waste in the grand scheme that would be the death of our out of the matchbox state of mind. For some reason, I just can't bring myself to light fire to the grand paper palace being built by those dolls that didn't follow the stencil, those paper, paper dolls, dolls like you and I. My eyes drawn with brown marker are crying and smearing and all the rest of the paper dolls like you and I are angry with me and I'm angry with me and the whole world is angry with me for something I never even wanted to do. I can't help it if I was cut into this unforgiving land that we were taught to share via old folk songs in free school. But we still don't know how to share our toys. How to share our ploys. How to share our boys. We, we still don't know and I still don't know how to destroy. How to rewind. And undo my grand entrance into this world but I know how how to make my exit out of the trash can or blue basket preschool and it won't be grand or big or spectacular. It will be silent as I tiptoe out of the classroom and into this earth full of live trees as opposed to dead ones like the paper, paper dolls, dolls like, like you, you and I. And this will be silent and painless and peaceful and I will be happy. So if you run from this blue basket world, my heart will burn and I will too. This matchbook matchbox mentality is just ripping me from the reality that lighters are much easier to use. The matches won't be here for eternity, and someone's about to take us out to a land where the sky may be blue, but the plastic is gray. This preschool playground is killing me, and I doubt the blue box will miss us. This blue planet that's unmoving, this blue planet where we are so worthless, the fresh paper dolls that are cardboard and stenciled are far more valuable, and I can hardly think locked within the sky. The green, bla the green basket planet is calling my name. The one with the triangle, demanding me we be recycled so we can find life all over again. The green basket is where it all can begin and we can lead new lives. Paper, Paper dolls, dolls like, like you and I. I.